Most gracious and heavenly Father, we come before you this afternoon, O oh God, just to give you thanks, just to worship you and to magnify you and to lift your name up, O oh God. We come before you as humbly as we know how, God, with the very things, the very issues of our heart, O oh God, the issues of our mind, O oh God, the things that come to weigh us down, O oh God. We ask that you help us at our, in our very point of need, O oh God. We ask that you deliver, restore, and set free your people, O oh God. We ask that you fill us up until we overflow and you give us the power, knowledge, and understanding that we need to make it through another day, O oh God. And Father God, I ask that you touch each and every person that's on this line, O oh God. Whatever it is that they're standing in the need of, O oh God, I ask that you come to their rescue, O oh God. Father God, I ask that you pop us up and let us lean not to our own understanding, O oh God, but your understanding, O oh God. Let us acknowledge you in all our ways, O oh God. No matter how we may feel in our mind, in our body, O oh God, I ask that you just come see about us, O oh God. I ask that you continue to give us peace that surpasses all understanding, O oh God, for no weapon formed against your people shall prosper. Father God, you've made us the head and not the tail. A lender and not a, not a borrower, oh God, you placed us on top and not beneath, oh God. And we ask that you continue to allow us to stand on your word, oh God. We ask that you continue to give us faith, even if, if it's the size of a mustard seed, oh God, to continue to walk the good walk, oh God, to continue to fight the good fight, oh God. Father God, I thank you for just being God all by yourself. I thank you for being our way maker, oh God, our redeemer, oh God. Our restorer, oh God. I thank you for being a lawyer in the courtroom, oh God. I thank you for being a doctor in the hospital, oh God. I thank you for coming to be a father to the fatherless, oh God, and a mother to the motherless, oh God. Amen. Father God, I thank you for continuing to intercede on our behalf, oh God. I thank you for calling us, for calling us mighty men and mighty women warriors, oh God. I thank you for being our Alpha and our Omega, oh God. I thank you for being our Jehovah Jireh, oh God. I thank you for being our battle axe, oh God. I thank you for continuing to be a mind regulator, oh God. Father God, we come before you and just place all our burdens down at your feet, oh God. The very things that we struggled with yesterday and today, oh God, we give it all to you, oh God. Father God, I say thank you. I thank you for the trials and the tribulations that came to sweep us up of our feet, oh God. But you allowed us to stand firm on your word, oh God. You gave us a strong foundation, oh God. You gave us the wisdom that we needed, oh God, to pass the test, oh God. You gave us the words to speak, oh God, not from our flesh, but our spirit, oh God. Father God, I ask that when people see us, they see you, oh God. They don't see the people that we were two years ago or five years ago, or let alone let alone ten years ago, oh God. But they see the person that you made us into today, oh God. Father God, I ask that you continue to anoint our hands, O oh God, so that we can do the work that you called us to do, O oh God. Uh, anoint our lips, O oh God, so we can speak the words that you called us to speak, O oh God. Anoint our feet, O oh God, so that we may travel where you have posi positioned us to travel, O oh God. Father God, some of us are standing in the need of breakthrough, O oh God, for our friends and our family members, O oh God. Some of us are standing in the need of restoration, O oh God. Father God, I ask that you touch the hearts of your people, oh God, those that hunger and those that thirst for you, oh God. And God, I ask that you also touch the hearts of those that have yet to know you and yet to experience you, oh God. Give them a, a supernatural download of your love and your affection, oh God. Give them a supernatural download of your power, your, gl your glory, oh God, your grace and your mercy, oh God. God, you've given us another day at life, and we thank you, oh God, for the life, health, and strength that you've given us, oh God. You've given us new grace. You've given us new mercy, oh God. You've given us new ways to go about fulfilling our destination, oh God. You've given us the power, oh God, to defeat the plan of the enemy, oh God. When the enemy comes to kill, steal, and destroy, oh God, we know that we can lean on you, oh God, and that we can speak those things that aren't as though they were, oh God, and we can decree, decree and declare, oh God, the things that we want, oh God, the things that we need, oh God, the things that we desire, oh God. Father God, I speak love, peace, and joy into the atmosphere, oh God. I speak restoration into the atmosphere, oh God. I speak financial breakthroughs into the atmosphere, oh God. I speak a supernatural download of your affection into the atmosphere, oh God. 
Father God, I ask that you touch each and every one of us, oh God, because you know what we're standing in the need of, oh God. Touch our ministries, oh God. Touch our finances, oh God. Touch our family members, oh God. Our friends, oh God, that are dealing with things that we can't even handle, oh God. God, continue to hear the prayers of your people, oh God. Those that are righteous, oh God, and even the, the prayers of those sinners, oh God. Continue to grant us a new day so we can be able to see our salvation within you, O oh God. Father God, touch Pastor Trey and touch Pastor Chantel, O oh God. Touch their ministry, O oh God. Touch their church, O oh God. Touch each and every person that's in the congregation, O oh God. God, allow us to continue to come together, O oh God, for your glory, O oh God. Continue to fill us up until we overflow, O oh God. Continue to overwhelm us and overtake us with your love, O oh God, with your peace, O oh God, with the very air that we breathe, O oh God. God, we thank you for giving us a second chance to get it right, O oh God. Father God, I ask that you stop by those hospitals, O oh God, stop by those jail cells, O oh God, stop by the courtrooms, O oh God, the schoolhouses, the bus stops, oh God, the homeless shelters, oh God, those third world countries, oh God. God, we thank you. Thank you, oh God, for life, health, and strength, oh God. Thank you for allowing us to press forward, oh God. Thank you for the shaking, the beating, and the pressing, oh God, for our oil to be able to flow, oh God. Father God, I ask that you continue to increase as we decrease, oh God. Continue to elevate us, oh God, and continue to separate us, oh God, from those people that aren't like you, oh God. But God, also continue to use us as a tool of influence, oh God, and don't allow us to be influenced by those outside things or those outside people, oh God. Father God, I come before you on bending knees, oh God. I thank you for the trials and the tribulations, oh God. I thank you for the test, oh God, because the test is not just for me, oh God, but it's for somebody else, oh God. Somebody besides myself is standing in the need, oh God. Standing in the need of a touch from you, oh God. Touch our minds, oh God. Touch our hearts, oh God. Touch our spirits, oh God. God, touch our soul, oh God. Renewing us a clean heart, oh God. Give us a heart that's pure like yours, oh God. Allow people to see the good in us, oh God, and not just our flaws, oh God. God, I thank you. If I can't say anything else, God, I thank you. I thank you for each and every person that's on this line this afternoon, oh God. I pray that the word that comes before me be a blessing, oh God. Speak to our spirits, oh God. Allow the word to manifest through us and within us, oh God. Let it fall fresh on unstopped ears, oh God. Continue to take the veil from over our eyes, oh God. God, I thank you for the very things that you're unfolding in front of my very eyes, oh God, with the people that are connected to me, oh God, the people that have come into contact with me, oh God, those that don't know how they're going to get it right, oh God, allow our life to be the perfect example, oh God, of how we should walk, oh God, of how we should talk, oh God, how we should do things, oh God, do the right things, oh God. Continue to instill in us, oh God, peace, oh God, patience, oh God, virtue, oh God, righteousness, oh God. God, open up a window from heaven, oh God, so we might have room to receive those many blessings, oh God, those breakthroughs, oh God. God, we come against the plan of the enemy on our lives, oh God. God, I thank you. God, I thank you. God, if I can't say anything else, God, I thank you. Oh, God, I thank you. God, you know all and you see all, oh, God. You sit high and you look low, oh, God. And, Father God, we ask that you forgive us, oh, God, for the very things that we've done that aren't like you, oh, God, the things that we said, oh, God, the places that we've been, oh, God. Continue to change us, oh, God. Continue to make us into who you called us to be, oh God. 
God, when I get weak, oh God, I ask that you give me strength, oh God. When we feel lost, oh God, I ask that you be the light beneath the tunnel, oh God. I ask that you just continue to just move and have your way on this line, oh God. God, we don't know the time and we don't know the day and we don't know the hour, oh God. But God, we come before you, oh God, we told me nothing, oh God. Have your way in our lives, oh God. We need you like never before, oh God. God, we thank you. Thank you, God, for just being God all by yourself, oh God. Thank you for making our crooked path straight, oh God. Thank you for giving us that supernatural birthing, oh God, to allow us to use our gifts, oh God. God, we thank you. God, I thank you for somebody on this line. God is going to get ready to give you a situation that's going to give you a testimony for somebody else. It might be your friend. It might be your family member. It might be your coworker. It might even be somebody that you meet on the street at the stop sign. God says, do what I've called you to do. Speak what I tell you to speak. Decree and declare those things that you want. I come to give you life, and I come to give you life more abundantly. I didn't put you on this earth to feel empty. I didn't put you on this earth to feel lonely. I put you on this earth to heal, deliver, and set free my people. Speak when I tell you to speak. Open your mouth when I tell you to open your mouth. There's going to be a time when I sit you to the side and tell you to be quiet. Be quiet when I tell you to be quiet. Allow me to fight your battles. Allow me to ruin the plan of the enemy. My God, go where I tell you to go. Touch who I tell you to touch. Release those things into the atmosphere that I tell you to release into the atmosphere. You're going to go to jailhouses, hospitals, the judges' chambers. You might even go to the White House. But go where I tell you to go. Speak what I tell you to speak. Touch who I tell you to touch. Mm-hmm. Oh God, I thank you. Be not dismayed because I've caused you to do these things. It's just a test for a testimony. Yes, God. Yes, God. Yes, God. It's just a test of your faith, and I need my mm-hmm. people to stay faithful. Mm-hmm. Thank you, Lord. Oh, God, I thank you. Run. Keep running to see what the end is going to bring. This is just the beginning. Stop when you get tired. Pray when you get weak. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Call out for me and I'll come see about you. Thank you, Lord. Ready, Jesus. Oh, God, thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, God. Oh, God, I thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Don't worry about what the preacher can do for you. Don't worry about what the congregation can do for you. Don't worry about what the first lady can do for you. I will do everything for you. I will come rescue you. 
I will yeah. pick up the broken pieces and put it back together. <laughs> I will heal deliverance, set free those family members yeah. that you've been praying for. Jesus. Jesus. Oh God, I thank you. Thank you, God. Oh God, I thank you. Hallelujah. Continue to be faithful, my people. Thank you, God. Don't worry about what you don't have because I will supply all of your needs. Thank you, Lord. I will continue to make you first because you've been last for too long. Thanks, God. Thank you, Jesus. Oh God, I thank you. Thank you, Lord. When your family turned their backs on you, I kept you safe from all harm and danger. When people said you were the outcast, I set you aside for a reason. Yes, Jesus. Oh God, I see you. When all hell is breaking loose in your household. I will come and see about you. When your spirit is weak, I will lift you up. Oh, God, I thank you. When your dad left you out in the cold, he said, I've been a father to you. Oh, God, I thank you. Oh, oh, I'm going to reveal those very things in front of your eyes, those people that you thought were for you. <laughs> the husband that you married, it's not his time. You were too early. Oh, God, I thank you. I'm going to give you separation so that he can continue to grow. <laughs> My God. Those finances that you're waiting on, I'm getting ready to give it to you. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, God, I thank you. Thank you, Lord. Those in-laws that you thought were your family, mm. my God, they were on the outside looking in. Mm. It was all for show. Mm. My God, speak to my spirit, oh God. Touch me where I'm broken, oh God. Yes, God. Yes, God. Yes, oh, God, God. I thank you. God said, I came to send you help. Those people that have been blessing you with the very things that you needed. They're here to help you, not hurt you. My God, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. This is Jesus' testimony. Mm. You're gonna go deeper. You're gonna mm. go deeper. Thank you, Father. Mm. Thank you, Jesus. I see you too hard to see what the future is gonna be. Hallelujah. You will. You, you will. Did you win? Yeah, I said I tend to give you all victory. Uh, I tend to give you all victory. Hallelujah. I tend to give you all victory. Thank you, Jesus. Yeah, I thank you. God, I thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Keep walking. 
Don't worry about who getting left behind. My Lord. Don't worry about who getting left behind. Quit walking. Don't worry about who getting left behind. My God. Thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. Oh, God, thank you. He says, I'm coming to give you fresh wind. I'm coming to breathe life into that situation. My God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. Oh, God, I thank you. Replenish. Hey, God.
We bless you now, God, from the word that is coming forth and the flow of your spirit. Now, Father, you are not done by far. You are not done by far, and we acknowledge that. And, Father, help us translate this over into our personal lives right now. Let us translate this over into our personal atmospheres right now because, God, you delivered a specific word to each and in individual person and also to each community represented here. And you have prepared us, God, for the next level. Now, Father, we declare and decree in this season that we receive everything that you have promised us, everything that you have set apart for us. And now, God, refill them that have poured out virtue now, God, and give them what's necessary for the next call. And we bless you now in Jesus' name. Amen. Listen, beloved, I am grateful for those of you that have joined us today. I pray that God would bless you, meet every need in your life, and you take this moment, this experience, and you go deeper. God is not done by far, but it's more than just for this line. It's for you now personally. Open up your hearts and your minds and ask the Lord to minister to where you are. And so now, God, I honor you, and I bless you for what you're doing, God. And I pray now, each and every one of you all, that you receive this. and tells you to do, you sacrifice where he tells you to sacrifice, you sow where he tells you to sow, but you be obedient where he tells you to be obedient. And you meet us back on the line tomorrow morning at 530 a.m. for prayer. Be blessed, beloved. Enjoy your day.